See in carborundum it is $38 profit now. Let's analyze the chart and analyze the levels. This was a level on early time frame. If we see the early chart, see this was R1 level on early chart and this is pivot level on early chart. So on 5 minute chart for intraday position these levels were acting as strong level and this was pivot point level. This was the opening candle then it was an up move near this level so it was not any confirmed position but when it was a sharp down move up to pivot point then this was the breakout candle I entered in a short position here. The first target level was this line that I got on early chart. So currently prices are very near to this level I am exiting from my half position. The sold quantity is 1000 shares so I am buying back 500 shares from this quantity. And now I am shifting my stop loss level at the break even point. This is my stop loss level. And S1 level is the support level so I am setting my target level at this level. So this is my profit target level and it is slightly above this S1 level. This is my half quantity and I have shifted my stop loss level at the break even point. And now in carbo random my stop loss is hit but it was only my half position. My half position was in profit and you can see here it was a sharp fall from this candle and prices are struggling at this level then it was a bounce up to pivot point level. Now if prices hold this level again we can see a fall in the stock up to this level but if prices hold this level in upside we can see an up move up to this resistance zone. Now in cargo random this is $31 profit with 500 shares so I placed my stop loss slightly below the pivot level. See I have exited first trade in which I made a sell position in the stock at this level. Uh, it was my half position and in my half position my stop loss was hit that was shifted to break even point and then I made a long position here with a stop loss slightly below the pivot level. So currently it is approximately 1 is to 4 R to R in this stock. So um, prices are trading very near to this level. I am closing this trade here. So in this case prices were below the pivot level but they are unable to touch this support level. There was a consolidation at this level that was the level on higher time frame chart and currently prices are very near this level so I am expecting a range bound movement at this level. If we see the 15 minute chart you can clearly see that prices are in uptrend on 15 minute chart and if we draw the trend line for this trend see this was a point on trend line and when today it was a down move up to this trend line and then it was a up move in the prices. So on 5 minute time frame this level was acting as a support level and it was a level on trend line so prices never closed this level in downside for intraday and I made a long position here at this candle because it was a pivot point level and above this level we can buy the stock so I made a buy position in the stock. 